Bonsby here. I'm at the Island Cinema in Mass Dick. And I'm going to be interviewing the Zen Enthusiast Network cast. They're the shadow cast for Repo, the genetic opera. Let's talk to them now. <laughs> Hello, what's your name? My name is Kat. Hello Kat, and what part do you play? I am currently playing a Gentur as well as a Zydrate addict. I'm Lauren and I'm a ZA, Zydrate addict, and a Gentur. Very cool. I like the fact that we're the same size. <laughs> Uh, my name is Chris, you could call me Crow Blackstead or Shadow. Um, and I play the guy who gets killed a lot. <laughs> oh, cool. Mm -hmm. uh, I play a, a ballet and also I play a... Um, a SWAT. Oh. Uh, my name is Matthew Reese and I actually play the, the Repo Man, uh, Nathan Wallace. Very cool, very oh, cool. I forgot to suggest something. And this, this is my time! Not... Sorry about that. I like how you dispatched him. Thank you. It's my job. I'm Donovan and I'm playing the Grave Robber. <laughs> oh, oh, Grave Robber. Hello, what's your name? I'm Wamsby. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm Cheryl and I play Shiloh Wallace in Repo and Shanika. I'm Elisa, Hedgeco, Asiatic, and Marnie. My name's Jord, and I play Amber Sweet. Very nice. What attracted you to Repo? Well, you see, I recently moved to Long Island, and I really didn't have a lot of people in my life, and I enjoyed Rocky Horror, and I looked up this amazing shadow cast called the Zen Room. And after going to one of their shows, I met this wonderful group of people, and they introduced me to the movie yes. Repo the Generic Opera. It turned out to be one of the greatest musicals that I have ever seen, and they said that they also shadow cast that, and I said I wanted to be a part of it. Cool. Thank you. Um, actually, I've known about the movie since high school, and I happen to be talking about it with a friend of mine, and he was in the cast, so I kind of got drawn in. Ah, uh, <laughs> one of us. You can't leave now. Don't plan to. Good. Actually, uh, what attracted me to uh, this show is I'm very much, very much into goth, and basically that's all there is to it. It drew me because of its goth overtones. Yeah. I like your helmet. Who made that for you? Uh, t uh, Tony, our prop guy, made this. He's amazing. He does all the props we do. He even did uh, my scalpel here. Uh, he does a lot of stuff. This actually does light up. If I can hit the right button. There we are. <laughs> oh, very cool, very cool indeed. Mm -hmm. What first attracted you to Repo? Um, I actually met uh, one of the cast members, Gabi, uh, at a New York Comic Con last year and became friends with her and she said for me to come down to the show and came down and had a great time in watching it and I decided, hey, why not you join the cast? Nice. What first attracted you to Repo? Craigslist. Oh, I'm scared right now. Um, a friend of mine actually like bullied me into watching it. But bullied? Yeah, but it's my favorite movie now. Cool. Anthony Stewart Head. I, think when you oh, I like him. I actually saw a commercial on TV for the DVD, and I had no idea what it was, so uh, it sounded really interesting just from the title. So I went on the internet and I looked it up, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to see this movie. I saw a video of Zydra Anatomy, I'm like, okay, futuristic world, glowing drug, I'm in. Oh, and of course, metal. Uh -huh. What repo song would be your theme song if you had a theme song? Well, it would have to be Side Trip Dammit because I play Amber. Mm. 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 Maybe Chromatria? Mm. 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 Oh. I actually got asked this question recently. Uh, I like genetic emancipation and infected, so slash. Very cool. All the shadows. Probably Side Trip Anatomy. Uh, definitely the song Thankless Job. I like that song. <laughs> it's a wonderful song. I get to murder people. That's tough. What would it be? Probably Zydrate Anatomy. 
21st century cure. If I had a theme song, it would have to be Testify. Because, I mean, it's one of those songs where it makes you want to get up and scream whatever it is that you think. You're going to testify. I think this? Yeah. If you don't think so. Ooh. Blind Mag has those electric eyes. If you could enhance one of your organs, what organ would it be? And keep it clean. Let's see. If I could enhance any of my organs, I think it would probably enhance my ears so that I could hear people were talking about me. I heard Clark Gable did that. <laughs> um, my pancreas, I'm diabetic, so oh, kind of an easy answer. I'm sorry to hear that. Eh, I just had pancreas awesome. for dinner. Probably delicious. Oh, it was. <laughs> What organ would I do? It's tough, you know. It's a lot of organs I would do, but probably my stomach, so I can eat more. <laughs> I like that one. You had to mention keep it clean, though. Yes, I did. Okay. It's a family show. Okay. <laughs> um, I would actually um probably go with the eyes. Yes. Because it's nothing cooler than having you know that kind of vision and having stuff like visions come out of your eyes. It clean. Hmm. That narrows down the list considerably. <laughs> Probably ears. Really? Really. Oh. Uh, I think it'd be cool to have eyes that work too. I have to wear contacts because I'm really blind, so well, not that one. I'm wearing contacts too. Appendix. Ready to make it useful. <laughs> Um, I have one last question for you. What would that be? What does Zydrate come in? A glass, little glass vial. A little glass vial? A little glass vial. And the little glass vial goes into the gum like a battery. A battery? The Zydrate gum goes somewhere against your anatomy. I don't like this now. The gum goes off its You're freaking me out. For surgery. Surgery. Don't kiss me. Done. I'm Long and we're here at Island Cinema for the Zen Enthusiast Network. Check out their website. So, do you young ladies like short green men? Only if they're willing to make genetics their Exactly. <laughs>